And away from that, the Association of Uber Drivers is threatened to go offline for two weeks due to the introduction of the Simbox technology and high discount rates for riders, which is at their disadvantage. Two weeks ago, the Association of Uber Drivers petitioned their management on some policies the company had introduced. Members said they were running at a loss as a result of the Simbox technology. Now they have introduced something they call anonymity. Now, it doesn't make sense because a rider cannot call me when I get to the destination. Sometimes I call the rider and the, uh, the call doesn't even get to the, uh, to the rider. Why? Because they are using a SIM box system. And now we have to call through the SIM box and then the, the SIM box will now route the call to the rider. And sometimes the rider might be standing right beside your car, but you're calling and the rider is not receiving the call. The drivers have described their partnership with the company as inconsiderate due to lack of consultation. Though it is an app, you choose to join, you choose to go, yeah. but it's in a way pushing too much pressure on drivers. And the riders have taken advantage of this. How can you drive somebody from trade fair to a suit five Ghana cities? No, no one. And when you get there, the thing is discounted 100%. The person pay nothing. More fire. We have fire. many evidences where somebody have to pay 100 cities, basically only 5 Ghana cities. Yeah. More fire. As discounted fare. How can this happen to a driver who had only made two sets in a day? They also complained of a high discount percentage to riders. Registering our displeasure at the price that they give us. Yes. Registering our displeasure at the 25%. Yes. yes. Registering our displeasure at the discount. Yes. Registering our displeasure at unnecessary blockage. Yes. No management member was present to address their concerns.